is Jeffrey. Hi, this is Jen from TTPM, and I'm here with a game for every Jeopardy fan looking to test their knowledge and or pretend to be quizzed by Alex Trebek. This is the Jeopardy card game from Mattel, and it's essentially that, a card game based on the popular long-running television game show Jeopardy, which tests contestants' logic on topics of all kinds. But don't worry, this game keeps things pretty basic in terms of potential subjects. The game features 20 categories, including animals, awards, Bible, food and drink, government and politics, history, holidays and observances, literature, math and science, medicine and health, movies, music, mythology, potpourri, presidents, sports, television, the US, vocabulary, and world geography. The game comes with one playmat, 56 clue cards featuring more than a thousand clues, 20 category cards, and 54 game cards. To set up, fold out the playmat and after shuffling all the cards up, place six categories on the top of the playmat. Then deal six game cards to each player. Note, you'll only use five per round, but having that extra card gives you a bit more flexibility if you're stronger in one category than another. Play starts with the youngest player and continues clockwise. What is cucumber? Yeah. Hey. On each player's turn, a player uses one of the cards in their hand to select a category. You may only select a category that you have in your hand. The color on the card corresponds to the placement of the category on the playmat. Another player draws a clue card and reads off the clue. What is a Christmas tree? Yes! If the player responds correctly, they earn points. Now, unlike the TV game show, this game is totally card-based gameplay, and so earning points is a bit different. You aren't buzzing in for clues or stealing other players' questions. Points are based on, on the cards you play and the amount of cards currently under each category. So if there's already a card what under is? the category, you are now playing for 200 instead of 100. There are three types of cards. Standard cards, each worth 100. Daily double cards, which work like a standard card but double the total value. and bonus cards, which double the value of that card. You can only play one daily double in the first round and two in the second round. Once that's been reached, all additional daily double cards in the hand become standard cards oh. in terms of value. What is the Avengers? Yay! Like Jeopardy, the second round is double Jeopardy, so all values are doubled. At the end of each round, players tally up their totals. Then it's time for Final Jeopardy. And just like the game show, players must secretly write down their wagers once the category is revealed. Then a clue card for that category is read aloud to the group. Everyone answers the same clue. Players reveal their responses and compare them to the actual answer. The player with the most points in the end wins the game. Overall, this is a game that is going to appeal first and foremost to Jeopardy fans. Clues, just like the actual game show, can be tricky and may leave you at a complete loss of words at times, but if you're into testing your trivia skills, this is the game to do it. We also think it will appeal to trivia night goers to prep and learn some new knowledge to drop on your opposing teams. The Jeopardy card game is from Mattel and it's for ages 12 and up, but will likely appeal to older audiences. It's a two to four player game. For more on where to buy and current prices, find us at TTPM and subscribe to our YouTube channels for more great reviews every day.